friends, it's Miss Jocelyn at the Lion Township Public Library. Welcome to online story time. So this week is Hanukkah, which is a holiday that's celebrated by Jewish families all across the world. And Hanukkah is a time to remember um, a miracle that happened a long time ago in the, um, in the history of the Jewish faith when they had just enough candles to last overnight, but by some miracle, the candles lasted eight days instead of just one night. Um, so why don't we start out with the more we get together and then we can read Hanukkah's story. Ready? The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Because your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. Can you sing with me this time? The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Because your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. Give yourselves a hand. Good job, guys. All right. This is The Dreidel by Abby Levine, illustrated by Paige Bill and Fry. And this book is published by Alan Whitman and Company in Marengrave Grove, Illinois. This is the dreidel Max takes from the drawer where he had placed it one year before. Let's see if we can get a better view here. This is the menorah down from the shelf. Max gets the polish and shines it himself. This is the rainbow of candles who choose one for their shmash and others will use. So the shmash candle is the one that goes in the middle of the menorah, and it is the candle that's used to light all the other candles. This is the sun sinking low. Time to start. So Hanukkah um, is celebrated in the evening once it gets dark. So they say that there are eight nights of Hanukkah rather than days. This is the blessing Max knows by heart. Over the candles his sister will choose, reds and yellows and purples and blues. In the menorah, down from the shelf, golden and gleaming, Max polished it himself. After the dreidel comes out of the drawer where Max had placed it just one year before. You can see there's Max lighting the first night's candle. Each night you add one more candle and you start on the right hand side and move to the left. Sorry, you might not have been able to see that on the screen. Start on the right hand side and move to the left. These are the windows where candles are bright. There's one for the shmash and one for each night. So on our first night, we have one candle and one shmash candle. On the second night there, we have two candles and the shmash, then three, then four, then five, then six, then seven, then eight. These are the gifts we give one another, mother and father, sister and brother. Max decorated a tall picture frame. Ruth drew the family and spelled out her name. Austin's going to try and fix this. Any better. These are the relatives at the door. This is what Max has been waiting for. Looks like Grandma Bubby is here and Grandpa Zadie. Bubby and Zadie are um, either Hebrew or Yiddish names for Grandma and Grandpa. 
These are the latkes piled on the plate. Max is so hungry, he says he'll eat eight. Latkes are potato pancakes, and they are something that is often eaten on Hanukkah. This is the dreidel Max spins on the floor. He hopes he doesn't get none anymore. So there's one Hebrew letter on each side of the dreidel. There's none, gimel, hey, and shin. To get none, you have to give back everything that you won so far. Here they are playing the dreidel. These are the stories we tell about. The oil and the flame that wouldn't go out. Antiochus, Judas, the great Maccabee, the temple soiled, the temple made free. These are the songs that we sing to declare that once a great miracle happened there. These are some presents of Hanukkah gelt. Battery quickly or else they will melt. So Hanukkah gelt is usually little pieces of chocolate that look like coins. So that's why they said they might melt. They might melt in your hand if they were chocolate. This is the pushki. It's a, and it's a good deed for Max to give money to people in need. You and your family might give money to charity to help people who are in need. This is the family gathered around watching the candles like stars burning down after the stories and songs that declare that once a great miracle happened there. The latkes and gelts and the guests at the door all of the things that Max waited for. The pushki that's filled, or it's a good deed to help other people when they are in need. The gifts that the family shared with each other, brother and sister, father and mother. Goodbye to the candles, so brave and so bright. Goodbye to the wonder of Hanukkah nights. This is the dreidel Max puts in the drawer till the eight days of Hanukkah come round once more. So Hanukkah, like a lot of holidays, happens once a year. And it, it lasts for eight days in a row. Sometimes it's around Christmas time. This year, it's right after Thanksgiving. So thanks very much for listening um, to This is the Dreidel. All right, guys, I'm wearing my fun story time apron um, and I've got some um, little colors that we can pretend are candles and we can do a little rhyme with them. Ready? Okay. Red is a fire truck, blue is the sky, yellow is wings on a butterfly, green is a grasshopper, pink is a bow, orange is apricots, white is snow. Pick the candles you like best. To light tonight, we'll save the rest. So if these were candles and we were lighting them um, on the second night of Hanukkah, we would light, we would have one that would be the chamach, and we would light two other candles. Oh, they would start over here on the right hand side. So we would light these ones. Um, and then the rest of them we would save for another time. Let's do it one more time together. Red is a fire truck, blue is the sky, yellow as wings on a butterfly. Green as a grasshopper, pink as a bow, orange as apricots, white as snow. Pick the candles you like best. To light tonight, we'll save the rest. All right, guys, that was fun. Okay, are we ready to wave goodbye and practice our open shut them? Okay. Open shut them, open shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them. Right up to your chin. Open up your little mouth, but do not let them in. Good job, friends. Let's do it together one more time, okay? Open, shut them. Open, shut 
them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them, right up to your chin. Open up your little mouth, but do not let them in. Good job, friends. Give yourself a hand. All right. So just like we named all of the colors uh, of the candles, you can also find colors all sorts of places in the world. You could play I Spy at the dinner table or on a walk or in the car. Um, if you've never done that grownups before, you say, I spy with my little eye something pink. And then your little ones get to try and guess what is pink that you see. Or your little ones might be the ones to say, I spy with my little eye something blue. And then the grownups can guess what is blue that they see. So give that a try. That's a little early literacy tip. Um, playing with colors and learning how color is all around us um, and just um, using more and more vocabulary is a great thing to do with kids and um, is will help to lead to early, uh, early literacy and um, someday lead to those pre-reading skills. So have a great day. Happy Hanukkah. And we will see you again next week.